Welcome to Art of One Dojo, where we build martial arts unity and we offer an online dojo for all. We are an interactive community forum and today I wanted to provide an update on what we have coming up on the channel. So we started in 2018 producing topics on history, training, health, and overcoming personal obstacles. We're going to continue to do that. However, over the past few years, we have received extremely insightful and constructive discussions from all of you and we're taking things to the next level. We're going to be expanding our content in order to one, touch on a greater variety of topics, and two, provide deeper and thought-provoking interactive discussions. So what this means is, in addition to our normal weekly shows, we will be adding a new program, Art of One Dojo Live. Now we will be making announcements soon on exactly when and how frequent this is going to launch, but there are many topics, several controversial, that we feel that we could really dig some teeth into. Now we did this a couple of months ago with an episode that looked at Kempo and we asked if it really worked. We had Aaron Cohen on as a guest and his background is a stunt and tactical training expert as well as having extensive military and martial arts experience. We got down and dirty and we put the art of Kempo through a grinder in an attempt at an objective and brutal analysis. Now we got a great response and we realized that there are a lot of subjects that we'd like to give the same treatment and to present them to you as a live topic so that we can all take part in the discussion and really get down to the bones of things, more so than we can in this standard episode. The show will feature a main discussion, as well as smaller story segments, polls, and answering viewer questions. We are also hoping to include some live guests as well, so we are really excited to bring this to you and take the martial arts content to a higher and much more engaging level. One of the topics we'd like to explore is that a few years ago, the UK banned all boxing and martial arts programs in prisons. Now this sets up an interesting question. Should martial arts be taught or allowed in prisons? Will it help with behavior management, or is it adding potential risk to a volatile situation? So we do currently have a poll up right now live on our channel in our community tab. So I'm really curious to know what your initial thoughts are and then we will expand more on that during the show. Other topics we are considering are, should students be allowed to use self-defense in school? How do you deal with discrimination in the martial arts? Threat assessment, where is the line of being healthily aware of dangers and going too far into extremes? When to de-escalate a situation and the proper ways to do so? and looking at what best arts are for law enforcement or security. So we're reaching out to you, the viewers, all of you guys out there. What topics do you want to talk about? They could be new topics or even revisiting previous episodes if you want to go into greater detail. This is a chance for us to take the proverbial gloves off and get down and dirty. Additionally, we may potentially analyze footage of real life martial arts in action. So that being said, we are putting out a call for footage. A common criticism of traditional martial arts is, if it really works, then how come we don't see it on video? That alone is a good topic for discussion, but if any of you out there have video footage of a particular art working in a real life situation, not choreographed and not set up, and would be willing to share it, and of course we can blur identities and we can omit details or apply user credit, however you guys want to work that out, then we could definitely provide opportunities to talk about the true effectiveness of all the different martial arts out there. So we are very excited to bring these interactive discussions to the platform. And now for those of you who are looking for a little bit of a lighter fare, we will also be trying a few more casual streams. In previous episodes, we looked at a couple of old school martial arts games in what we called Retro Dojo. So we are converting Retro Dojo into a new alternative live stream show where I'll be doing stream playthroughs of older martial arts video games and we can casually hang out, have fun, talk about what media impacted our training, and just talk about martial arts in a less formal setting. And finally, on a more important note, we are proud to announce that we will be supporting a very special nonprofit organization that uses the martial arts to help children combat cancer and other life-threatening illnesses. The Hero Circle was founded 22 years ago and it is a global healing and wellness initiative inspired by the children of kids kicking cancer. They are a 501c3 nonprofit organization that offers evidence-based martial arts therapy to kids. Their focus is on pain and stress management for pediatric patients, as well as creating resilience and support for their families. Classes are delivered in person and virtually throughout hospitals, community organizations, medical facilities, outpatient centers, and camps and schools across the world. Now, I personally fully believe in the impact and value this organization provides, and I had the personal pleasure of speaking with Richard Plowden, who serves as their chief martial arts therapist, and for those of you who aren't familiar with him, he has an extensive experience in competitive tournament fighting. Now, we got into the details of the program, so look out for that episode coming next. So here we are folks, we are now entering a new phase of Art of One Dojo, an opportunity for us to chew on some good topics and to provide some real good in the world using the tools that the martial arts have to offer. Now, take a look at this aggressive yet objective discussion on Kempo and then leave a comment down below or on the Kempo video to let us know what other topics that you would like to see discussed at this level. Let's crack it open and build something special.